Uh, let's see how we can solve uh, this budget violation problem. The question is the cost C of feeding an orphan at the last orphan energy center is partly constant and the battery varies inversely as the number n of orphans present. So now the, the feeding cost is a hundred and fifty three thousand kwacha when there are third orphans and uh, it is hundred and forty six thousand kwacha when there are forty eight orphans. So we have been asked to calculate the feeding cost of forty orphans in the orphanage center. So what we are going to do here, solution when dealing with the budget violation, uh, we should note that we have two constants, two mechanical constant away. As you can see, have partly constant and in a party values inversely. So I have it depends it or inversely or it or directly. So it depends. So uh, formulating an equation using the first part of the question. So we have C as our cost uh, is partly constant as part A plus and the other part which is inversely the number of uh, orphans present. So we are going to have this constant part A and another constant here part B. So when you are writing an equation you are going to write C is equal to a then plus uh, 1 over n then here times k so 1 times k uh, it's k so we can write this one as a k over n the good we are going to use this one could divide the value of a and k the uh we're going to take this pair this one and we are going to take a, that pair, could be the value A and K. So taking the first part, we have um, 153,000. So we are putting here 153,000 uh, is good. A then plus K over N. How many orphans are there? We have 30. So I'm putting 30 here. So this is a 30. Now, John um, Dibange, we need to remove this denominator here by multiplying the variables in the 30. I've also did that in the 30. And this guy here, we're going to multiply in the 30. So what will happen here is uh, this 30 and that 30 will cancel. And we are going to have 30 times 153,000. So uh, we have 30 times 153,000 which is a uh, 4 million 590,000 so here I'm having 4 million 590,000 is good and the product of A and 30 the answer is 30A then plus K there uh, forming a equation number 1 and another equation will be formed using the other pair, this one. So you may divide, we have 146,000 kwacha. So I'm writing here 146,000 kwacha is equal to A then plus K over uh, N. How many authors are there? So we have 48. So I'm writing here 48. So like we did here, Chomudi Bange, uh, we are going to multiply here by 48. I've also did them and the 48 and the, this one 48 as well to remove that uh, denominator. So what will happen here, uh, this 48 and that 48 will cancel and the 48 times 146,000. So I'm having here uh, 48 times 146,000 the answer is 7,008,000 kwacha so here I have uh, 7,008,000 kwacha is equal to if you multiply this the answer is 48a then you plus uh, k and you have formulated equation number 2 now what will happen here is um, we're going to solve these two equations 
simultaneously so the best we can do uh, we're going to use the elimination method so uh, let me take this one take it you'll tell also so let me copy it and uh, put it here so i'm putting it there did you tell so that's the thing to you tell above so I have uh, seven million eight hundred thousand. Uh, this one, do you tell me four million five hundred and ninety uh, thousand? The answer is uh, two million four hundred and eighteen thousand. So I'm having here uh, two million four hundred and eighteen thousand is good uh 48a minus 30a the answer is uh 18 18a and k and k will cancel k minus k that's the uh zero so what we have in here uh we need to find the value of a by dividing both sides in the uh, 18 so i'm dividing here by 18 also on the other on the 18 so this one and that one will cancel remaining with a so here i'm having a and the answer will be the divide divided by 18. so this one divided by uh, 18 the answer is 134 then triple three to the nearest that is so you have one one three four then triple three so this is the uh the value of a and what will happen you are going to use this value of a could it be the value of k so we can use the equation either this equation or uh, that equation so let me take this one so what will happen here um i'm having four million five hundred and ninety so five hundred and ninety thousand is good a family value a take up this guy so we have one three four then triple three then plus uh k i don't know and the, here i forgot to multiply this with the uh, 30 i have a 30 there then a plus k to find the value k mind you i have choose then this equation so for many a like a couple this guy and the 30 the mini alibi so what we have in here i have four million five hundred and ninety thousand is good 30 times that number so you will never say yeah then we can come at the the 30 the answer is four million and thirty thousand so i have here four million uh thirty thousand so here we have uh, plus k so to find the value of k as usual we're going to take this guy uh, right your tail. so i have um, four million five hundred and ninety thousand minus four million uh and thirty thousand is equal to uh, k so what we have in here um i'm writing four million five hundred ninety thousand minus four million thirty um let me start again four million uh, thirty thousand yeah something like this so the answer is a five hundred and sixty thousand so here we have uh five hundred and sixty thousand as our value of k Ah, too too much so that's the value of k and the, this is the value of a so what will happen here did get my values if i were to get substitute in this uh, equation so to find the equation connecting uh, cost a and the k so the general equation the as the c is equal to a tabizagudin the 
one three four triple three we have um, one three four then triple three here then plus k that is a good it's this one which is five hundred and uh six thousand then here divide by n so this is the equation connecting a k and a n we are going to use this equation here could it be the uh the cost of any number of orphans now uh from the question does the good we should find the cost of feeding 40 orphans so what will happen here pali any pali any pa take a couple of 40 in the general equation so uh cost c cost c is about one three four triple three here then plus uh tnd five six c ten thousand then divided by n here 40 uh, and then we have c is about one three four triple three then plus and so when is age even get divided into 40 so we have 40 here and so i could work 14,000 so we have 13 14,000 so the cost of feeding 40 40 orphans will be the sum of these so 14,000 take up particles in the 134 triple three so that one plus 134 then triple three the answer is a uh, not uh, minus but uh, we have to subtract 134 triple three then plus 14,000 the answer is 148,000 kwacha uh, 148,333 kwacha so we have 14833 yeah so this is the cost of feeding uh, 40 orphans let me check it again yeah so that's the thing here so this is how we can solve it according to the question about the mind you if you have enjoyed this video please don't forget to subscribe to my youtube channel as well as liking my facebook page unique online classes malawi so that's it for this video thanks for watching and i wish you all the best